All right guys, so welcome to Project 8020. So this is a little something I've been working on. Um, essentially, we're gonna kind of just go through some of the things that I do on my own. We're gonna start from the very, very basic, basic, basic of movements and circuits, and we're gonna work our way up from there, okay? So I'm gonna walk you guys through a circuit real time in just a minute, but first we're just gonna talk about quickly um, some of the movements. So basically we've got about five movements, and we're gonna be at each of them for about 60 seconds, except for the last one, we're only gonna be there for 30, okay? Now I'm gonna talk you through this first part really quickly, and then we're gonna go through it full speed ahead, and I got an assistant somebody you guys might know that's gonna come help me out all right so let's start first let's get down in your plank and we're gonna chit chat about this whole thing so first we're gonna start in a plank and we're gonna alternate a toe touch now um, instead of piking up I think with um, that like a lot of you guys are used to what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull our foot in so we're gonna start in our plank now once again first things first make sure that your hands are underneath your chest okay make sure your abs are tight make sure your booty's not all up in the air Make sure your hips aren't sagging, okay? Stay nice and mellow here. Okay, keep your abs nice and tucked. Now, for this first one, all you're gonna do is you're gonna flex your abs, but you are gonna lift, bring one hand in, touch, bring the opposite in and touch, okay? Try not to let the body twist too much. Keep your core nice and tight. The trick on this one is to really, before you lift an arm or a leg, really make sure that you're just keeping your core nice and tight, okay? From there, we're gonna go into a dead man's push-up. Alvin, what's a dead man's push-up? Let me show you. You're gonna lay belly down, just like so, okay? You're gonna open your arms up. Don't let your hands touch the floor. Bring your hands in right at the nipple line, okay? Just from here, and then you're gonna flex your abs and boom, push yourself up. Once again, drop yourself down. Arms go out just like so. Bring your hands in like so. Boom, there you go, that's your push-up. From there, you're gonna bring your foot up outside of your hands, okay? Turn, twist, open up your chest, Look up at the ceiling, put that hand back down, step back into your plank, step up with the opposite foot, turn and twist, look up at the ceiling, okay? We're gonna alternate from there. Now, from here, this is where shit gets cool. We're gonna bring our, shoot our knees in, keep your butt down, stay on your toes, hop your feet back, and then you're gonna give me a push up. Well, I'm gonna show you one more time. You're gonna hop your knees in, knees back, drop down, give me a push up. And from there, we're gonna finish with a nice solid mountain climber, just like this. Keep your butt down, pump your knees, keep your abs nice and tight. Whole set, four and a half minutes. I can't lie, you will be sweating. Arms are gonna be smoked, so on and so forth. So, like I was saying before, <clears throat> since I'm gonna be coaching you guys through this, I'm gonna bring somebody in to help me out. This guy. You had, to you had to wear the Alvin. same thing I'm wearing too, huh? Jerk. Drop into your plank, please. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Remember, okay. make sure your hands are underneath your chest. Okay, fine. Make sure your butt's not way up in the air. Okay, make sure it's not sagging down below. Draw your belly button into your spine, okay? We're gonna start. We're gonna bring your right foot to your left hand. You're gonna alternate. We're gonna hold that for 60 and go. One. Now, you note this is a lot harder than it looks at first, right? Try not to rock your body. Unfortunately, Alvin's not doing a very good job here. Okay, so again, wanna make sure that you keep your core nice and tight, okay? It's okay that you go slow, this isn't a race, okay? Remember, keep your core nice and tight. Try not to rock your body, bring that knee up, touch your hand to your toe. You're gonna alternate your 30 seconds deep. Okay, you got another 30 seconds left. How are you feeling? You good? Okay. 20 seconds. Now, once again, once you, if you feel yourself starting to get a little bit sloppy, tighten it up, okay? Slow down a little bit. Now, from here, we're about to go into a dead man's push-up, okay? Alvin's gonna show you what that looks like. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Good, drop down. Open your arms up, don't let your hands touch the floor. Bring your hands in and then give me a push up. Remember to keep your core nice and tight. Push from the floor, drop yourself down, arms out. Bring your arms in, fire those hands up, just like so. Good. Don't worry about speed. Once again, take your time, okay? Open your arms up, bring them in, fire them up. Good, perfect. Good, 30 seconds deep. Uh 
Oh, well done, sir. Looking good. I'm gonna need you guys to show this guy what's up. 20 seconds. Now from here, you're gonna bring a foot up and you're gonna do a little bit of a spinal twist in three, two, and one. Awesome, here we go. Bring that right foot up on the outside of your hand, turn and twist, look up nice. at the ceiling, bring that hand down, step back, step forward with the left side, turn and twist on the other side. Once again, take your time. I want you to open all the way up, reach, look up your arm to the ceiling. You should be able to draw a straight line from one arm to the other. Step back, step forward, twist, good. Amazing work, 30 seconds, you're halfway there. Now we got another push-up variation coming up. Now this is where shit's about to get hard, so believe it or not, this is probably one of the slowest you're gonna move for the rest of the set. 20 seconds. Good there, big guy. 10 seconds. Now from here, you're gonna hop your feet in and out, your knees in and out, you're gonna stay on your toes, and then gonna give me a push-up. So three, two, one, good. Jump through with a push-up, knees in, in, out, push-up, good. In, out, put, oh, getting tired, right? So what he just did was he went into a pike just to get a quick breather, which isn't exactly a breather, it's a little bit, still a little bit harder on your shoulders. Just make sure if you do that, you are driving up from the hips, okay? Also, in addition, you can jump in, jump out, and you can do that push-up from your knees if you like. Once again, this is not a race. Go at your own pace. See? 30 seconds. Oh, you ain't tired. Let's go. Come on. You got 20 seconds. And then from here, we've got 30 seconds worth of mountain climbing. 10 seconds, five, four, three, two. Now let's go, give me those mountain climbers, let's go. Bang, 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 let's go. Keep your butt down, pump your knees. I know your arms wanna give up, hang on. 20 seconds. Ten seconds. Finish strong. Finish strong. Finish strong. Finish strong. Finish strong. Five, four, three, two, and relax. You got thirty seconds rest. We're gonna do it again. All right, guys. So two times through. Nice solid core movements, core exercises. Believe it or not, you feel that a lot more in your chest and triceps. You can vary the push-ups a little bit. Obviously, you can vary the push-ups a little bit. Um, by doing so, you can vary what parts of your chest and triceps. You can do hands in a little bit tighter, a little bit more triceps, hands a little bit wider, gonna hit more of the chest, okay? Really appreciate you um, going on this journey with me. I got a lot, lot, lot more to come. Um, just getting started. Um, if you liked what you saw, share, subscribe. If you have any comments, any suggestions, please feel free, let me know. Once again, my name is Alvin. Um, this is Project 8020. I really appreciate your energy. Thank you so much. Um, like, subscribe, share, all the things. Erica Badu said it best. I'm an artist and I'm sensitive about my shit.